Hello friends, welcome to Karma Tech. In this video, I'm going to explain how can you compress video files in your Mac. So if you're new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe. To start with, first of all, you need to download a free software named Handbrake. The links for the software is present in description. You can go and check it out. Uh, once you download the software, you need to install it. And the procedure is actually very simple. Now I have kept two videos on my desktop to you know for demo purpose we are going to use this short one video if i show you the info of this particular video you can see the file size is 151.7 megabytes and it's a 4k video and it's shot at 30 fps you can also check out the codex over here so after compression we are again going to check out the file size so let's open the software now once you install an open handbrake this is how the interface looks like you need to go in open source and select the folder where the video is present. Select the video, select open. It will scan the video and once it is done, it will show you over here. If I show you the original video, it's a simple video. And as I told you, it's shot at 4K at 30 FPS. So once the video is imported, after that, we need to start with preset. So currently it is set to fast 1080p at 30 fps but our original video is 4k so we are going to select 4k uh, you can go in general there are few presets already present over there you can check it out but also you can check out the format it is av1 now current format is mov if you want it to mp4 i'll show you the process for that you can check out the codec here as well if you are a creator you can go in web uh, you can you know uh, select the 4k preset over here currently it is at 60 fps but the video is 4k uh, if you want for social you can select that particular option so yeah there are multiple presets you can check it out it, there is preset for amazon fire android apple chromecast and there are much more presets available over here but i'm going to select web over here and creator 2160p to 60 fps 4k so our original video is at 34 fps how can you change it i'm going to uh, you know guide you through that but now current format is mp4 you can see also you can check out the codec it is h.264 audio codec is aac it's stereo and currently as i told you it's 60 fps to change the fps you can go in video and over here in frame rates you can select this drop down and you can select the original frame rate again one more thing you can go in dimensions usually there is no need to change anything over here but if the cropping uh, you don't want any cropping you can select and you can select none over here so these are the basic changes you can do while you know before compressing the video again uh, you can go in summary you can check out the details uh, if you want to apply some filters there are some filters if you want to do some changes in video if you want to increase the size um, now i told you how can you change the frame rate but if you want to increase the quality of the video you can use this quality toggle over here if you move it to right it will increase the quality if you move it to left it will decrease the quality now it depends how much you want to compress the video as per that you can just control this so once everything is done all you need to do is you need to select start option before that you can also select the destination where you want to save the video so you can select this browse option and you can select any particular folder where you want to save it so everything is done let's start now it will take some time to save the video or compress the video and once it is done it will show you in the destination folder now currently the video is in process so we are going to wait so the compression is complete now you can see this was the original file short one which was mov format now this is the compressed video which is short one and it is in mp4 format if we check the quality you can see it has maintained the quality definitely the video is not you know the quality is not decreased or degraded a lot the video is still looking good and if we check the size of the video now currently you can see it is 47.9 mb and the original video size was 151.7 mb so as i told you if you want to increase the quality you can use this quality toggle to adjust the quality so yeah that's how simple it is to compress video in your mac without paying any money it's completely free so if this video was helpful you can hit that like button and before going don't forget to subscribe i'll see you all in the next one thank you